In this video, I will share my six-step formula for deciding which product to promote next as an affiliate content creator. Impact is a marketplace for affiliate programs, and each program within it may have its own rules and payment options. It's important to carefully review the terms and payment details of each affiliate program you consider joining. Let's see how to apply to different affiliate programs within Impact. After login to your account, go to the Brand tab. Here you can search for brands that you already Already know or explore categories. I always check affiliate programs very carefully before promoting them. If I'm not using their products or services every day, I at least visit their website and social media profiles to see what others think about their offering. If it's software, sometimes you can get free trailer to test it out or find unique ways to showcase the product. If you want to promote affiliate programs on your website, there is a fantastic tool available that can automatically generate content for you and publish it on your WordPress website. The link to the playlist is in the description. If you don't have an impact account, it's a good idea to make one and wait for approval. After that, you can apply to any affiliate program you want. You can create an affiliate account even if you don't know which product to promote because it takes a few days to, up, to get approved on Impact. Later, if you find something you like with an affiliate program through Impact, you are ready. And let's see how to apply through the market level. From your homepage on Impact, click on Brands. Then on the left side, you can find ways to search for new affiliate programs to promote. There are categories where you can choose your niche and find product related to your audience or the audience you plan to build. You can also search for program based on features like getting paid for leads or sales. You can search by location of your audience, either local or worldwide, or you can see what assets you receive when you join an affiliate program. Let's look at some affiliate program within the categories. By the way, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing, giving it thumbs up. I'm choosing the B2B category. I look at different company there, specifically something I don't know for this example, to show you how I check it. Let's find out about vid.io. I click on the image to see the terms and some information about the company before I apply. Let's see what they have in the description. Vid is a powerful online video editing platform that offers a range of tools and features to help businesses create professional looking videos quickly and easily. Before I start my research, I want to know if I can apply for this affiliate program. I'll check the terms to see if they are looking for a big audience. Some affiliate program only accept affiliate with certain number of followers, like 5,000 or more. They might check your audience side through the links you provided in your account setting and assets. You can watch the video on how to do that. The link is in the description. I open their terms. They offer a recurring payment of 30% for a year, meaning you get paid every month for a year if the customer remains subscribed. I like recurring payments. They provide stable income. <laughs> payments are transferred to your impact account 47 days after the customer make the payment, which is common in affiliate programs. On the second tab, you can find more details and by scrolling down, you can visit their website. I'll review the pricing in terms of the product to see if it's something I would use myself. Even if I don't use the product, I sometimes consider promoting it if I can see its value and potential use. They offer a free plan, so I can sign up and evaluate it first hand. This approach allows me to confirm if they deliver what they promised and see the cons and the pros of the product. After using the free plan, I ask something to their customer service to see how long it takes for them to reply. This helps me understand their responsiveness, which is crucial when deciding to promote a product. Good customer service is very important. Let's go back to Impact website. Before I sign in for the pro option, I always apply for the program. Sometimes I have been rejected. If that happened, I don't buy the product. This way I ensure I can promote the product before investing in it. To apply for the program, you click on the apply button under the program you want to join. Then you can add some words. Since I usually apply after researching and can tell them about my plans to promote their product and the type of content I intended to create. After applying, your application will be pending until they approve it. Some websites approve anyone very quickly, while others take more time. If you filled in all of your information in the setting, it will be easier for them to see what you are doing and approve your application. You can check the status of your application in the tab labeled Applied. All the programs you've joined can be viewed in the My Brand tab. 
after trying the free version and deciding it fit my needs, I buy it for the first month. Some features are only in the paid version and you can really understand the product if you have access to all the features. If there is no free version, I check their return policy. If there is a refund option within a few days, I also buy the first month. If I find it's not good for a promotion within a few hours, I ask for a refund. But if it's good, I use it for a whole month before canceling. Sometimes if I really like it and don't have something similar I already use, I keep it longer while promoting it. Once I understand the product and know its pros and cons, I can begin promoting it through video content and blog posts on my website. If you want to learn how to fill out your public profile to ensure you get accepted into the affiliate program you want, check out this video.